Water Board is now responding to the accusations that one area of town is getting undrinkable salt water. As we reported last week, a group of residents sued the company. ABC 7's Juarez correspondent Eriberto Perez has the update. I spoke with Juarez residents about their water issues in Anapra last week, and now I get the chance to speak with the Juarez Water Board on what are they doing to fix the problem. Pues están en todo su derecho de demandar lo que ellos creen que es justo. Daniel Valles is the spokesman for the Juarez Water Board. He says residents have the right to complain and demand what they think it's fair. In the lawsuit, the group of residents is asking for 40 billion Mexican pesos from the Water Board. That's about $2.3 million. The money will be given to about 6,000 people who live in the Anapra area. Valles says the Water Board wants to address this issue and for people to have drinkable water. Hubo un pozo o dos pozos que hace un par de años eh, se, les, se encontraron que los niveles de sal estaban eh, arriba. Valles told me a couple of years ago two water wells were suspended. He also told me the water problem hasn't been solved because the area has been problematic with higher levels of salt than other neighborhoods. Y también eh, hacer que la gente entienda que el agua se tiene que pagar. He also said thousands of residents are connected to the water service illegally. The water board says it was provided several spots where people can pick up over 10 gallons of drinkable water per day free of charge. Bayes also told me there is a plan to place a new water tank of over 1.3 million gallons of water. In Ciudad Juarez, Heriberto Perez, ABC7.